What's going on, y'all? This is the one and only Amir Driver, better known as A-Driver, also known as Lil' Four Wheel, Mr. Made in Norfolk himself. Right now, you are tuned in to the Live from the 7-5 podcast with my brother Kells, Blazing Heat Rock, and Miss Cakes. Make sure that you tune in. Stay locked. We right here, y'all. Driver! <laughs> Heat Rock. We got a live from the 75 Podcast crew. Episode six in the works right now. Episode six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on with y'all? What's going on, Blazing? What you been up to? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> I see you just bought some new DJ equipment. Hey, bro. look, man, you trying to get me robbed out oh, here? Oh, my bad. Yeah. My bad. I seen price that about nine ninety eight too. Yeah, nine dollars and ninety eight cents. You know I'm cheap, man. I buy them <laughs> oh shits at the Goodwill. Hey, we out here. I'm counting dollars too. I'm counting. I see them. I seen him. Oh, you get that? You got that from the Godzilla movie? Oh nah, my gosh. nah. <laughs> See, Planet Fitness had a sale for their local DJ that that, that stepped out. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I know that's the joint you're going to. So they don't have no DJ. So okay, I might DJ I your you. shit when you have your sets. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Definitely, definitely. Oh, I fuck with that shit. Protein pancake eating ass. <laughs> hey, what's going on with you though, Cakes? What's up? What you been up to? So I don't know if I can share this legally, but I was working today. Legally. And yeah, legally. I mean, uh-huh. I, I'm not le- releasing any names, but anyway. Go ahead. Um, All this shit. Definitely thought about blazing heat rock. Um, I was minding my business in the psych ward in the hospital, and a patient was singing "Bad and Bougie." Hey, talk that shit. I was conf- <laughs> I was confused though because I thought the goal was to get out, but I mean. Sometimes you just gotta hey, the side, the side chicks like Bad and Bougie. That's why I keep them around. Oh, I like that I, song. I, I psych, I'm trying to get somebody said, to pay that car note. I said psych ward, though. Hey, that's crazy. Literally. That's literally, literally crazy. crazy. <laughs> Straight jacket. That's crazy, crazy. For real, for real. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. But what you, who you listening to right now, Cakes? Oh, so um, definitely listening to Intellect. Um, that's Beach Boy Like on Instagram. A-T-I. Yeah, ATI Die. ATI Die. Um, I fuck with some of them. Go ahead. <laughs> Yeah, some continue. Who you don't fuck with, though? Yeah, that's hey, what I would. We'll know. talk about that shit later. <laughs> for another podcast. I'll definitely remember to bring it up. Pull up from forty shots fired. <laughs> Shoot your shot, twenty seventeen. By the way, well, who you bumping to right there? So this is directly from Beach Boy Lack. That's B E A C H B O Y L E K. Every Thursday, I'll be Spelling dropping test. some unreleased material. Um, Sissy Strut Freestyle was last week's drop, which was very dope, by the way. Okay. That's Beach on the page. Bo- yeah. Beach Boys will be this week. Mm-hmm. Check out that SoundCloud for all your needs. His link is in the bio. SoundCloud, Intellect, ATI, Die. Theodore Thursdays, all that good stuff. Okay. Cool. Cool. Blazing, who you listen to right now? Anybody? Um, Shout out to Cook Babes. He dropped something today. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 um, definitely. I did check that out. You know what I'm saying? I always support my guy. Cook Bay's on the page, too, as well. Um, to be honest with you, just, you know, when I'm not doing this podcast, I'm actually listening to the podcast, just trying to engineer it. So I'm listening to, like, a lot of podcasts right. just to get my shit right. Okay. So I'm right. be honest with you, I haven't listened to no music like talking about in the last yeah. week or so. I did listen to 3-6 Mafia today, though. You know what? Matt Randall. I'm not with that. We we not ready for that yet. Though. Nah, nah, you know nah. Y'all gotta get y'all music game up. No, you know we not saying? ready for that discussion yet. Though. Nah, fuck that shit. Um, <laughs> cold blooded. Nah, I'm gonna I'm be real. I've been listening to uh, Kirk I got Franklin. that take that take go crazy. Um, I I pulled that mixtape back out. So hey, um, Tay got a couple of visuals right now out, and that's on the page as well. And I'm also listening to uh the guest that we got on episode six right now. Episode six. Yeah, you know uh we got. We got Mr. Nephew in the house, crown up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks for having me. Thanks for having me. You know what I'm saying? We definitely uh, appreciate you coming through. You know what I'm saying? And uh, you know, we got we got some good questions for you and all that. But uh, we definitely was looking at you from 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 afar. You know what I'm saying? And definitely me, I seen you know what I mean where you started from as far as the music. Uh, but I seen where you started from like you started battle rapping first. Yeah, definitely. You know what I'm saying? So. Uh, uh, that was my main thing, you know what I'm saying? Like, you you started from the battle rap and then you translated a, into the music. Yeah. And, you know, a lot of people can't seem to do that. So, uh, like I said, we definitely saw that, and I was like, man, we gotta get we gotta get nephew on here. He's definitely up and coming, and uh, I feel like 2017 you might have a you know what I mean a strong year. 
I appreciate that, man. I'm trying to, man. That's all I'm doing. I'm trying to put on for the time, for real. That's all. That's what's up. That's what's up. So uh, I'm going to start off like this, like I start off with everybody. Who are you bumping to right now? Other than yourself, who who you listening to? Um, I listen to bro, uh, Don Q. Okay. A Boogie. A Boogie. I seen um, a lot of people talking about A Boogie lately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I like um, I like the Young Boy, NBA Young Boy. I like NBA Young Boy too. NBA Young Boy. Yeah. Okay. So all those lovely artists that he mentioned, make sure you send to your work to um, live from the Southern Five Podcast at gmail dot com. Those local artists? No, no, no. Those I know, artists. I know. Young NBA, young, with the young dude, whatever his name is, <laughs> I don't be paying attention. Actually, you know what? He, 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 he got a charge, don't he? Yeah, 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 yeah. He, he, he down right now. Well, I mean, that's cool. Though. <laughs> whoever, whoever you're listening to, I just want to know who you was listening to yeah, right yeah. now. You know what I'm saying? But uh, let's let's start, let's pull it back a little bit though. Like, where you, where did you start rapping from? You know what I'm saying? Like, what age or when did you know? Like, you know what? I, I want to start rapping. You know what I mean? I, I feel like I I can put words together well and you know what I'm saying I wanted to transition to, to music. I started um I started in school, you know what I'm saying, where you had like English class they give you like po- poetry assignments or whatever. Mm-hmm. And I always did well in those. So then I just started listening to music from my pops. He just always had all the DMX tapes, you know what I'm saying? So like DMX, my classic, beat, classic. all them type rappers. Okay. So that's where I come from. So then I just was like anything I rap about, you know what I'm saying, you gotta be dope because they dope. You know what I'm saying? I feel you. So I just, you know what I mean? It just came from that. And then I was shy at first. I ain't really let nobody know I could rap. But then, you know what I'm saying? I let like two of my homeboys know. And then they'll put me on the spot in front of everybody. I'll be like, chill, man. You know what I'm saying? But then I just gained some confidence. I was going to say, now it doesn't seem like you're shy at all. Yeah, yeah you don't I, seem shy at all. That must have been a while ago. That's yeah, a facade. Yeah, yeah. Yo, IG be booming. Yeah. You know, <laughs> you, don't seem, you definitely don't seem like you shy anymore, man. Yeah, yeah. So, so if you, you know, who who's your influences growing up? What rappers were influenced you to actually rap? Uh, Petey Crack. Okay. Yes. Petey, um, Petey. That's a rock. That rock. That, that's a rock shit. Talk that rock shit. You know what I mean? <laughs> Petey, Petey <laughs> Crack, Young Chris. Um, you definitely was, Mob Deep, Nas. Okay. Um, Pop. Good lineup. Big Pun. I said pun already. Oh, you, nah. you got a lot of light skinned brothers on there. Oh yeah, yeah, gosh. you know. I mean, he <laughs> light skinned himself. He the lightest person just, in here. I just beat that out. I was like, oh, Peedy, pun. That's some light skinned niggas on this. <laughs> this guy might be Dominican. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but nah, nah, nah. That's what's up. That's what's up, though. That's, nah. that's definitely a good list. That's a different list from a lot of other people that you would have probably asked. You know what I mean? You probably could ask. No ho? You probably can ask 20 oh, rappers. Definitely, definitely all the, uh, I mean, you know, the staples. Come on, hold on, hold on. He just named some rock people. So you know I was going to say, though. Yeah. Had to be on I'm the list. Glad, I'm glad you did because I definitely get a lot of flack. Like, you got to let that whole yeah. mentality a lot die. Of people, <laughs> a lot of people like, contact us and say that we talk we about whole riders, too much. But uh, shout out to our father, Hope. You know what I mean? I feel like we don't talk about Jay-Z enough. Enough, that's right. But, he got that $200 million deal yesterday. Hey, hey, that's what's up. That's what's up. Ho, if you listening, let me borrow $5. <laughs> nah, that man need to let us borrow more than five. Yeah, five. Yeah. We'll borrow 15 because I got kids, man. 500000 <laughs> <laughs> Okay, no problem. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, Pretty good so, info. So you, you came in with them influences right there. Right. You know what I'm saying? And then you say you let your homeboys listen to a couple of things. They was feeling it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So when you say, yo, like, maybe we should take this and record something. You know what I mean? Like. Uh, I was just curious as to, you know what I'm saying, how to do it, because I was listening to all my favorite rappers, and I was wondering, like, how did they do that? You know what I mean? Because some, some of the songs you could actually hear back then, you could hear when they punched in. Uh-huh. So yeah. now that I know about it, I'm like, okay, that's how they did that. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I don't okay. got to waste my breath trying to get it all out in one take. <laughs> I, can, I can actually punch in. You know okay. But can, can you do it in one take, yeah, like, yeah, hold? Yeah. One take hold. One take one take hold. One take hold. Sixteen. Did you know how to count bars when you was rapping, or you just never, it just never, came natural? Never. I just okay. let me tell you something. What I do, I just do the outline. I do the hook, uh-huh, and then place the hook at the end, yeah. and then rap in between. Because a lot of people, when they start off rapping, from my understanding, they don't know how to actually rap sixteen bars. Yeah. They don't know it. So yeah. you know that's that's dope that you actually know it when you. Look, when I'm you 29 started. years old, and I don't know what. How to count bars, nigga. I definitely. <laughs> like, I don't even know. Ever. You know what I'm saying? I don't even understand where you for. 
Is it, I don't know how that. I mean, works. they t- they taught you that in music class though. Back yeah, in the day, no music class. It's four four time yeah, most of the time. Four, I didn't take so no music class. Oh yeah, because you went again. You went to the. Oh my gosh. To the um, people that pay their taxes on time school. Hey, shout so me out. So what school? They had to take a couple Section Eight babies, man. He went again. You know what I'm saying? No, I said what school did you go to? Oh, I went to Granby Elementary. Shout out to Granby Elementary. Y'all went to the same. Granby, nah, yeah. he went to Granby. Went then you know, oh, what I'm saying we, one. I went to Blair. I think that's where we met. We 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 went to Blair together. Oh, I went yeah, to Blair. we met. We definitely met. Went to Blair. Like seventh grade. What time you go? You went to Blair. What, what time? Um, right? Middle school, middle school, sixth and seventh grade. Um, I graduated in 09, So, okay. oh yeah, we was out of there by. I then. was gonna say, how old are you? Yeah, he's young, young That's one of my. This one of my youngins on the list oh for gosh. 2017. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's just one of my youngins on the list right here. So you you say you listen to your faves and you um you actually back in the day you can hear how they punch in. You wanted to know how they did it. Mm-hmm. Um, what's what's your humblest recording experience? Um, like bef- before you were able to get into a studio. Before it was in the studio, it was on a tape recorder. Okay, it was on everything like. Anything you could name, like if it could, if it had a, a voice memo or anything, flip phone, an old phone, our yes. parents ain't want. Talk that real shit. That. Talk that real. Not yeah. tight that so he was, he, you was right there at the end of the tape recording era where you yeah, where you I, heard a track on the radio. You was like, I gotta hit that record button. They, yeah. A lot of people don't know about the, yeah, the, the young don't. youngest. They, they don't know about they that. Don't even know what a tape is they might nowadays. Not. The millennials, yeah. that's yeah. what they call them. The millennials. They just don't know about no tapes. I mean, we uh, we technically part of that group. Yeah, we like nah, the yeah. We we, 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 we the it. elders of that group. Yeah, nah, I'm a, I was 87. We you know what I'm saying? I mean, I'm in a drug 87. era. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Cracking my drawers. Like, nah, oh. I, I didn't have it, but you know. Oh. <laughs> Fez, Fez, listening. It's my boy Kells. Hey, I pay my taxes. Listen, <laughs> listen, listen. We were fooling y'all. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But like, let me let me let me go back to the uh, you know what I'm saying to to the music though. Yeah. You. I mean, we we going in 2017, but 2016, the end of 2016, I feel like you came real strong at the end of that year. Um, one, I really liked was the E track that you did, um, the cover for um, what's it, Young and May. Yeah, I definitely liked that. Um, I thought you were spitting something. I said, man, he he warming us up. I feel like he got mm-hmm. a little bit more on that, under his sleeve. You know what I'm saying? And then you came with the uh, somehow somehow some way track. Right. And I'm gonna be honest. I still listen to that. Like, I feel that, you know, what I'm saying, like, I, for a minute, I almost was like, yo, this, this. I forgot it was somebody else's. You know That's what I'm saying? What a lot of say. people. Though. Like, those, I forgot it was somebody those else's song. Those are my favorite covers. So, like, I listen to his your version of Eat, mm-hmm. and I'm like, oh my gosh, who is Young and May? Yeah, who because you know what I'm saying. <laughs> I feel like you is, you took their beat, and, and and this is a hundred. You know what I'm saying? I feel like you took their beat, uh-huh. and you almost made it your own. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like. That somehow some way joint, I almost like literally forgot that that was somebody else's song already. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was like, damn, this nigga spitting it. <laughs> and I was re- <laughs> everything that you be rapping about is relatable yeah. to what we actually seen growing up or you seen nowadays. You know what I'm saying? Depending on you know where, where you I live at. Situation. You know what I'm saying? So um, I just was like, damn, man, he talking that. That's I'm, it's it's like a rhythm, you know, saying like a vibe. I'm if glad it, Kels mentioned that though because I I was lis- I listened like um, nonstop today because I knew you were coming. Yeah. Um, and I wanted to like bring up good topics, but I'm thinking, hmm, I feel that everything that he's rapping about is real, and yeah. it's none of that like, do you really live that life type lyrics? Yeah, it was like I would never 100. question your authentic authenticity. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got that word right. I just word. like it that, you know, your, your music doesn't sound like you from Atlanta. Exactly. You know what oh I'm saying? God. And that's that's the main thing. Like, mm-hmm. you know, you know, the uh, the artists in the seven five, shout out to the artists that's doing it, but a lot of these artists in the seven five sound like they from Atlanta. Probably never been outside of two sixty four. Right. You know what I'm saying? So for you to have that sound, I don't know if it's a Norfolk sound. We don't know what the Norfolk sound is. Yeah, we, we but it's a sound that not Relatable to the Atlanta sound, and that's yeah. I think that's the, the key part right there yeah. is that makes you stand out compared to a lot of artists. Not saying every artist in the seven five is sounding like that, but that's right. you know saying you have a niche where you don't sound like another artist, and I think that's a good a dope thing. So you sure, you so. covering people tracks and making us forget about the original artists. Yeah, you you're creating dope. your own lane. Okay. No no mimic sounds. I can't man. It's just I don't know. Like I, you know, how some people feel like they really was made for something. Like I yes. really feel like that. 
And then, like, it used to be days where I wake up and be like, man, I don't want to rap no more. Because of what you just said, a lot of artists sound like that, and that's what they take to. So I'm like, damn, I don't even fit in. But then I'm like, forget fitting in. I'm going to stand yeah. out. You, you got to make your own lane. Yeah. Then I got a lot of people that, that rock with my movement, CMK, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So I can't let them down as well as myself. So I just so go So with that being said, explain your recording pro process and where do you record at? Explain, explain those two. Majority of the recording that I do is at Radio Ready, um, record with my JB. Is JB still I, over there? Well, that's his yeah, studio, right? Yeah, that's his joint. Okay. I used to go there back in the day. Can we get a sponsorship when, over there? Yeah, oh, JB, holler at him. Holler at him, man. What's uh, up? When Kino was over there, I don't know if you, I know he, Kino booming right now, he so I know he's he in and out, so I know, yeah. know about Radio Ready a little bit. Is that the only studio you record at? I record there. I also record with uh, Bless at Soundscape. Bless. Okay. We got yeah, yeah, yeah. I got. I see you out there, blessed with the camera. We bless, see you. Bless yeah. out see there you. doing some things too. I seen a couple videos from Bless. Fire. Um, that I just stole off his page and put on our page. Shout That's out to so Bless. <laughs> so uh, explain your recording process. What do you do to prepare for whatever track that you you gonna attack? Um, basically, I just hear the song and I hear the tempo, and then I just I just vibe out. You know what I mean? Whatever comes to my head or whatever I'm feeling about anything, however I'm feeling about anything, I just write it down. And I just attack it, try to attack it in a different way though that's not like predictable that everybody would do. I try to think of it as a different way. Yeah, you know so, so that's what I, going off of that, the the track seven, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yes. The, the newest track that you got out right now is seven. Questions. Seven um, cities. You know what I mean? Like I said, Kate's got questions for you, but coming to like listening to that, like I felt like you was definitely like, like like the whole mindset for that track was I gotta put on for my city. Yeah, definitely. you know what I'm saying. And I feel like a lot of people say they want to put on for their city, but when I hear you say you want to put on for the city, like I really feel it in the music. Like this yeah. nigga really yeah. love the so seven five seven. He really want us to be on, be on the map. Like the way the people from the East Coast. Is it East Coast? West Coast, West Coast make you feel like when you listen to the music, like, oh man, I wish I was there. Like, whenever I hear that seven track, I think, how could you not love being from this area? Even yeah. though I already love where I'm from. Yeah, definitely. But like that's. <laughs> I'm not from. She's yeah. from the hood. I'm not from Gant. Pop place. <laughs> <laughs> no, but when I hear that track, it's like, wow. This is what it's like to be from the 7 5. And like, yeah. you, you portray it in such like a good way. It feels good. Yeah. I'm proud. Thanks, man. I don't, um, with that track, you know, um, seven, like, I don't know. I don't even know how to. That was a good idea, too. Like, I, that I, was I, pretty like dope. What, what kind of feedback you been getting from that from that song? A lot of people like it. Like, I had put, like, an Insta, a Instagram video on Instagram, like, a minute long. Just me in the studio, just vibing to it. Yeah. Rapping along to it. And I got it. I listened to it. Everybody was like, yo, that's going to be crazy. I, I tagged a couple of people in it, man. And, um. Just a couple people been visiting my page, Waka Flocka. I went to my um my story and looked at the viewers, and it was him. Oh wow! I clicked on the page. It had to the verified check. I was like, oh shit, this is crazy. Yeah, that's what's up. Status. Now you know you got a good song when like you you catch yourself singing it and you don't even realize you're singing it. <laughs> so I definitely don't know all the words, but I know I, seven I, maybe. Yeah, but I, <laughs> I like the you know lucky number seven. Like it, yeah. and then it just. From yeah. that, it's just like, okay, and then Old Town that I'm rapping, like, uh -huh. it's, it, it, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like one of them. It gives a good, a feel, it, a good it, feeling. Yeah, and it's like, it. it's like, I don't know if it's, it, maybe it's, it's like, it's your voice, the yeah. voice that you got, like, you, like, 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 like Blazing said, it doesn't, it don't match nobody else's, you know what I'm saying? So it definitely stand out. Right. But then it's like, I'm not trying to come on some super hard rapping mm -hmm. about guns and crack and this, and the third yeah. is like, I'm going to give you where I'm from in the we aspect from this. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, I'm listening to it. I said, yo, he got three solid back-to-back-to-back -back -to -back joints that That's you can you can bang right now. You know what I'm saying? Wait till the tape comes. Uh, okay. <laughs> so, 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 so you got a tape coming? Is I got a tape saying? coming, man. State of mind, state of mind. Okay. Uh -oh. you, got a you got a date for that? Uh, nah, I ain't got no date. Drop a date. Drop a tape. No date in time. I'ma name it state of mind. So what we need is when you come up with a date, we are gonna record you, and you need to record it or just give us a drop. Yeah, we we put it in whatever episode. Yeah, yeah. That, yeah, that, that seven that track exclusive. was for y'all, man. Live on the seven five. That's I, that's why I told Cakes about it in the DM. I said I got an exclusive for you. I sent it over. 
So you check that out first. You know what I'm saying? We definitely have look, to look, figure out. Let me out tell you to... something. Hey, he got his look, he, he about, to, on, he about on, to be mad because nah, he listen, like listen. our. Nah, shut up. Got... Time out. Oh, Kale's run the social Yo, no, media no, hold network. On, hold on. Yeah, it's, come on now. <laughs> Good or bad. Too. Listen, listen, listen. <laughs> I, I run this uh, uh, the IG, you know what I'm saying. I'm gonna be. Thank you for the clarity. <laughs> I run the IG. I yeah, say know. it again, because you know what I'm saying. No I'm, 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 I'm gonna let it be known. I run I the want IG. No problem. Kels. You know what I'm saying. Um, seven five. Kels seven five. Spell I run it. the IG. How James Kelly doing? for anybody who wants to go. Any emails, anything like that? Uh, they handle the emails. No, um, but I definitely. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Because they want to get sued. If you get it, listen. If you get an email, it's from them too. Uh, if it's word spelled wrong, it's from Chris, uh, which is blazing. I'm, t- if, <laughs> I'm telling if, you, the nigga edit game. Hence, hence the blazing and black, Asian, blazing. I was born in Korea. <laughs> English my second language. We're going to rock it with that. Say, Listen, uh, that the, my man editing skills is horrible. Oh, But anyways... <laughs> Let me get back to what I was saying. So listen, <laughs> um, if you're going to DM somebody an exclusive song, send it to no, no, how no, you no, not no, no. send it to me? Look, we was already in a conversation about Thank you. something else. You know what I mean? Not nothing crazy, but we was already in a conversation about something else. Crickets. And I just happened to be done with the song. So I just, I just told that. I think out. I tried so, to look, recruit look. you for the show before... They talk to you, right? No, 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 no. Kale's a little hurt over here. He hurt, man. Uh, We're gonna have to get back. Get back to the music. Get back to the music. I'm gonna get back to the music one second, bro. How you not gonna send me the exclusive? I I put her and him (laughs) on to your music. It's like Kale's kind of telling to the teacher right now in class. You know what I'm saying? He he wants a star right now. Kale's got his hand up like he in class right now. I just didn't get the exclusive, and I felt like I should have got it first. That's all. He in the principal office right now, snitching. No, but you know what? In all fairness, when you sent me when you DM me and told me about the song, didn't I tell you to email it to the to the email? He did. Who checks he the did. email? I don't check the email. Cakes batter. Uh, that's not my lane. <laughs> everybody has lanes here, and that's my, that's not my lane. So everybody, Kale's lane is the social media. He he's the one for the DMs from I'm live from the seven five. I'm the one here <laughs> doing it. You know what I mean? So just nah, know. you take care of that. We appreciate it. I'm just saying. I was trying to. Uh, yeah, it's all well, good. let let everybody know what our roles are. You know, so just this. Nah. My role is uh, Instagram and booking guests, right? Kate's role is, I don't know what Kate's role <laughs> is. And your role <laughs> is got there going. We get the uh, audio files. A role we... with rice on it. That's what oh, your role man. is. Oh, I love sushi though. Yeah, that's his role, Asian. You know what I mean? I but anyways, a... go ahead. You got questions? I got a home? question for Nuffy. Okay, go ahead. Okay, so I was listening to the E Freestyle. There are some lyrics that I wanted to address, uh-huh. get you to, to clarify uh-huh. for the people who may have been, you know, like on the fence, like, oh, maybe he was talking about me. Maybe he wasn't. Yeah. Okay. Um. So one lyric, I don't know if this is right. Did you say, I don't want to deal unless they sign us? Yes, 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 yes. Okay. So I'm um, thinking about like different scenarios where like um, the main artists get on. So like, say like a Meek Mill and then he try to bring, um, what is it with him? Dream, dream chasers with them, yeah. and then like the, it doesn't play out as well as they want. So like I know they have good intentions of trying to get the other artist signed, but it doesn't work as well. So like explain that for me. How important is it to you to stay loyal to the people who's been with you since the beginning? Oh, uh, they they stuck with me. Like a couple of us got this on our skin. Like we got CMK on our skin, so they stuck with me. Like once I get on. Like they it's, good, like it's and easy. And I was talking about when I said unless they sign us, I'm talking about the other dope artists that's in the area. Oh, okay. Cause they good, they with me. You know what yeah. I'm saying? They're part of me. That's just what that made me think of. But that's really good though, because like, um, like you rap really hard for the area, which I really like mm-hmm. because I want to see like a really good artist like come from here and stay true to the area. Yeah. But then when you just explained that you meant like the other good artists in the area, that brings up my next question. I'm glad mm-hmm. you said. Um, I got a question for days. <laughs> um, you you got mentioned a thesis over here. <laughs> <laughs> I listen to lyrics. I told y'all that you can't just be bad and bougie for the rest of your life. It's, <laughs> you it's not gonna work. No, it's, it's not gonna work. It's for the twerkers <laughs> out there. Ask that, ask that question for them, man. <laughs> no one twerks in this room except for you. Who the truth is that? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, I think you said I'm not sure. It's no shade. I just know it's only a few in my lane. Exactly. And then you mentioned. 
being top five. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so okay. You, so, so that's our number one subject <laughs> on the on top. So, five. Yeah. so if you're if you're in your top five, he that's said. one of five. So Name the other four. He said I'm top I'm five. I don't care what nobody for, say. That's for anybody to decide. But I just know that I'm one of them. You know what I'm saying? What's your top five? So my top five. Before, oh, before, before you, you five no, he's before. he's one of five. So who's yeah. the other four? Before you make this list, now you know this 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 part gonna drop Friday. So by Saturday, it's gonna be some bars thrown at you if you. <laughs> so you gotta think about this list. We're gonna no, 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 no. They, they, they gotta think about throwing them bars. That's Ooh. right. That's right. <laughs> shots fired. Shoot your shot. Twenty seventeen. It's mean, not just no. That's that's not because he just said that he doesn't want to get yeah, signed right. unless they sign yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. Everything is for the city. And but everything is opinionated. Jesus. Everything is opinionated. But we want to yeah. know your top five. You what's, already named yourself. Go ahead, name name. So what's the four other four? Other people? What's the other four? You feel like is. If just, you can name them outside the camp, that would be great nah, too. We you know, yeah, locally, yeah, seven five. Locally, um, I like, I like, um, I like Paige. Okay, y'all know Paige. Yeah, I like Paige. Um, hey Paige, Young Lloyd, <laughs> Driver. <laughs> I fuck with Driver. Okay, hey Driver, that was hey, episode Driver. one, first guest on the podcast. Um, Mount Mount Fisher. Okay, Mount. Okay, okay. See, y'all just catching on. Y'all just seen them last two videos he dropped. But I oh, know. No, okay, no, so we, we got history with Mount. Now. Yeah, yeah. I have a theory about that. I'm talking about the people though. They, oh, the they people. Just, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, they yeah. forgot murder Mount. Okay, so you said yourself, Mount Driver, Paige. You got one more. You got one more. Um, Give me one more. One more. That you that you rocking with? Uh, I like. Uh, damn, yeah, that's a lot of pressure. There's one more left. <laughs> and, you, and you can have an honorable mention, too. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, nah, ain't no honorable mention. You nah, need to nah, get the, you need to get the hate right. that I get. I can, I can hear the pens to the pad <laughs> right now. <laughs> no, 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 no. Nah, oh, they need, writing on the pads you need right to now. Get you only, you only got four? No, 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 no. Don't pull a Chino on me. You know it's going to be it's <laughs> gonna gonna get a whole another episode dedicated to you only giving four. Because people don't like that. Nah, my homeboy, I like my homeboy, too, man. His name's Swagger. I like him, too. Okay. He okay, dope. so you get that's that, that's five. That's five. You know I think I'm I'm familiar with him, but not really by that name. And I didn't know he rap either, so yeah, that's pretty yeah, cool. Yeah, he dope. Okay. Okay. You got any more questions for him? Yeah. Honorable mention. Uh, everybody from the city. Shout out to y'all. See, no, no. I like that. Yeah. What city is it? It's, I'm from Norfolk. That's Norfolk. Right. But that's but right. I, I mean, I put on for the seven. For the seven. That's oh, right. What, what part of Norfolk? Everything for the uh, seven. I'm from Lambert's Point, but Lambert's I went to school Point. out in Norfolk, so I be okay. out both areas. Lambert's Point, shout out to my people out there. I used to steal my grandma's car in the back road back there on 26th oh Street. Gosh. That's where I learned how to drive. Lambert's listen, Point. Man, listen, You're going to hey, get listen. convicted from what There was a lot of backseat action in my, hey, in my Honda Civic back in the day. Stop, Chicks stop, back there. We already said you know no listen, sex. Stop trying to fool people, man. You're from Colonial Place, man. I, 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 didn't, say, I didn't say I was from Lambert's Point. <laughs> That's I, I, I right. I had a lot yeah. of time. Out he there, but you don't care. You know, what I'm I used to, I used to skateboard with the white man. boys. You know, shout out nah, to them. They used to, you know, they used to hook me up with the, you know, oh, from it, man. some things. He oh wasn't, he wasn't, he wasn't there. <laughs> hey, look, man, you, you know, know what I'm saying? suburban part of the hood. Hey, look, man, but you know, shout out to my suburban people. You, you know what I'm saying? The, but you I lived to, in the flood zone, man. I used to get my tree out there from Lambert's Point. <laughs> shout out to them. You know what I'm saying? Street Music Car and Audio Security has been providing the seven cities with your car audio, security, and accessory needs for well over 20 years. From customs to ground buildups to simple radio installation, from the rims and tires to the custom interiors to the custom stereos and more, they're your one-stop shop located at 2714 Monticello Avenue between the corner of 26th and 27th Street in the heart of Norfolk. Call Street Music at 757-624-1717 or visit their Facebook and Instagram page at Street Music 757 or just stop by and holler at Kenny Bug or Deshaun or the rest of the staff over there. They will help you keep the music on the streets. So you 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 ignited us with some heat. Mm-hmm. Now you can't go backwards. Oh yeah, you know it's, it's, uh, it only gets better. You know what I'm saying? You can't go backwards now. So what you got planned? You know for 2017. Like I said, I got the tape "State of Mind," "State of Mind" coming out. Then shortly after that, I got another tape called "New VA." Okay. Um, we already working on that. We'll probably I like that. that idea too. Like when you say new, new VA. VA. Yeah. That's what does it mean to you? Just the new VA, like new it's, wave that's of us. VA. Like we, so, we, we so trying to come I feel up. like new VA with the name itself. I feel like you gotta you gotta have some some features on there, some dope features. Yeah. Man. Anybody, like I said, shout out to everybody in the city that's dope. If anybody want to work. My my email, all that is in my bio. You yeah, because I could that. new VA. Like nah. I feel like that should have like a driver on there. Yeah. Uh, it should have yeah. a, a mount on there. A it. breeze. It should have a crazy on there. Like yeah. 
I, I'm Same. feeling like the name itself. Yeah, like, NBA. like I feel like that's why I said you one of the rare artists who I feel like really it's not even just Norfolk. It ain't even just the beach. It ain't even Port. It's like as a whole. Like I, I'm just trying to put on for the seven five itself. Right. Like a lot of people don't. You know what I mean? Like they don't transition into that. Like I feel like you transition into the like I'm I, I'm with. The seven five, and that's what I'm rolling with. That's what I'm rocking with. Like you can't change that. You know what I'm saying? I think that's the mindset. That whole new VA mindset that's gonna get you signed. I hope so. Yeah. Yeah. I see it. I Hi. see it. You got a manager? Cause you know, you know, live on the seven five, we branch out. We do it all. That's right. right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey, Keep us in mind. We us AKA mind. Rock Nation over here. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look, we could we could definitely we, have we, a conversation off this. You can't even say that. We we <laughs> we got blazing on the team. We rice nation over here. Oh my <laughs> God. Yeah. If you need a personal trainer when you get signed, you know your boy oh right next God. to you. Man. Hey, security. You got protein powder I'm security, by the bundles. Yo. I'm security out here. Rice protein nation. powder by the bundles. <laughs> so so he mentioned you working with other artists um, right. this year. Do you have any features right now with anyone? Oh uh, yeah, I got. Um, other than like people in your camp. Yeah, I got features with. With Ether, Lord Ether. I oh. fuck he, with Ether. He, he, he shoot my video. I fuck with Ether though. It, it, and Ether just I haven't even, I haven't even seen him. on the scene he, for some he reason. Definitely I don't know what's going on with Ether. He she, disappeared. She I called shooting. Ether out and I said, Ether, like I, I I needed I wanted to hear that. You heard the black composers that he did before? Yeah, yeah, definitely. With him and Timmy P and all that. Like I, I called him out, I don't know, was it episode two, episode three, whatever episode it was. But I said, yo, I really would like them to work together again. Mm-hmm. And then I, he just disappeared. Like if Ethan, if you listening, like bro, I mean sometimes he got something in the cut. Yeah, he got that's, something that's he's working on. Is. Okay, oh, well if I'm you working sure. on something, I ain't gonna talk shit yet. Yeah, yeah. But nigga, so, you got two more episodes to drop some <laughs> shit, or I'm gonna fry that ass. So you work with Ethan? Who else? Um, I got a song with Crazy too. Crazy. Okay. I fuck with Crazy too. That was my prediction too for 2017. Crazy. Crazy. I'm about to do a song with Paige. I talked to him yesterday. Okay. Me, I like Paige song. a lot. That's like my. What's that? Cousin. Evolve. Evolve, right? Yeah. Evolve. Okay. Um, and I got, I man, I got a couple more. Uh, I can't think of them off top. Okay. I mean, Who's and your I got favorite? a couple more to do too. Who's your favorite feature so favorite far? Favorite feature. Um, like your, like I want to say the easiest person to work with, but like your, I guess favorite feature. My favorite feature. Um, I don't got a favorite feature. You cause I'm not done yet. Okay. That's cool. Talk that shit. So man. I fuck with nephew. We, we talking about features and stuff. Nephew with the shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's we, my one of we, my favorites right now. We we talking about features and stuff. Mm-hmm. So what about producers? Any local producers in the seven? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like um I like Beat King. I like Kino. Mike Kino. Um, who else? I like uh it's a couple of people. My cousin. My I got a cousin. He's dope too. Okay. I got some. What's his name? Shout What's him? Shout him out. Nito Nito Beats. You know what I mean? So I'm about to do a joint off this. He ain't even say his name. Yeah, yeah. Shout out to the cousin. Let me let y'all rappers know out here. Y'all paying for studio time. Y'all better be paying for these beats out here. I'm trying to stick up for my producers out here. Don't be having a Gucci belt on, not paying these producers now. Oh my gosh. $15 to lease the beat, G. At least. At least. He talking, he put he putting y'all on right now. That's a that's a jewel right there. So do you ever work with people like you're really loyal to the area? Do you work with people outside the area? Yeah, yeah. Um, I got a couple. Like I said, I got a couple features to do. I got a dude from Jersey. I don't know how serious he is with his music, but what's his name? I'm like, nah, hell no. Nah. Yeah, he ain't from the seven. Okay, <laughs> cold blooded. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, envy. Who else? Keep that shit going. I don't know. Uh, any producers out of the area? Just nah. pretty much. We have really good everything here, like at home. We definitely do, and that's my whole point. Yeah. Because why need why do he need to work outside when he can I'm get it all here? Yeah, good never home cooking. I will though. But I'm just saying like he, right he, now he like, has to reach out. Not saying he has to, yeah, but reaching out good. because you can have an audience. If you have an audience outside the seven, that's mm-hmm. when you know you're doing something. When somebody yeah. that never chilled with yeah, you before, I feel that. you yeah. gotta think a, a lot of the uh, the artists in this area, their friends, you know, they, they help them out. Yeah. Not saying that they don't have you I, know, fans, I feel what you're saying. I feel but what you're if going they had if they had you know, an audience outside the area that lets you know I mean, they're really you know, doing Once something. you drop the tape, you know what I'm saying, um, get a tape to us, you know what I'm saying, we'll have Chris uh, take it to China with his, with his <laughs> oh people. Oh my gosh. And She's once he get to China, bro, uh, we out there. You know what I'm saying? We lit. You know what I'm saying? We out there. Once we oh, get yeah, there, yeah. that shit is going to be... Okay. Hey, and after we that. take it to China, we're going to take it to Trinidad. Hold on, you hear that? He said, he said a release party. Let's have a release party? Live from the 7-5 at the release party? I could give y'all the tape at the end of the week. 
I'm gonna give oh, it that's y'all, great. Y'all, nah, y'all. Listen, nah, listen, listen, listen. Hold on. Before, you know, before, before, hold on, hold on. Go back. What I tell you, who get the exclusive? <laughs> my bad. My, my, look, I'm, <laughs> and we ain't I'm editing this part. I, I need my shit 24 hours before them. Oh my god. You know he needs some. What he's trying to say is he needs some workout music. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. He be in the gym <laughs> all day, day, man. When the, when the podcast you know over, I'm gonna go work out. So it is what it is. But look, what's the what's the? I see you doing clothes now. Oh yeah. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. I see the CMKs. I seen them all over the, the IG recently and all that. Definitely. You know what I'm saying? What what was what was the the, the mindset behind that? Um, a lot of a lot of artists they'll be really great at music, but then they'll suck at the business part, mm-hmm. or they'll be great Facts. at the business part and suck at the music. So I wanted to be both. So I went out and I tried to, you know, me and my cousin we came together and we created CMK. And everybody that's around us is a part of that. And we went out and we um we really put on for it and branded it. Well, did a it. good job. And we got clothes, ski masks, everything you can name, like anything. I needed that ski mask yeah. when it was snowing. Yeah, <laughs> definitely. definitely. <laughs> I, I actually, I, I think the I think the logo is dope. Um, I yeah, like I the like shirt. Um, I, I definitely like the shirts, or whatever. I definitely like the hats. Yeah. I feel like the dad hats is dad the new has movement. Now. You know what I'm saying? I got a dad hat on right now. Kate's got a dad hat on. Yeah. Trish got a goddamn no for ties, <laughs> but you know I'm you know, I'm representing the city, so no, you know I'm either way. I'm joking. Either way, I, I couldn't even. I was I had a Chinese joke for it, but I couldn't get so it. So you out. couldn't think about it. Nah, it's a tsunami yeah. on that down here. <laughs> <laughs> and you know we editing this shit too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> nah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? But nah, um, I do, I do like the movement for the for the for the clothes, man. You know I definitely do like that, man. Um, like I said, the hats is the new the dads is the new thing. So I'm I'm definitely rocking with that. It's great promotion, man. We got lighters coming to uh, coming soon yes, too. Yes, y'all gonna lighters, sell out. Lighters, lighters. Yeah. I definitely want. I want to see you on a couple couple cars. Um, you know what I'm saying. I definitely want to see you on a couple cars this year for 2017. I want to see you on, on somebody's stage, man. I, I reached out to a couple people, but you know, I I, I think um I, I think you should probably that. get on to uh what's the, what's the joint trapper for cheap probably. You you heard about the trapper for cheap thing? Nah, let's let's hear about. It. I mean, well, I don't think I don't think it's the same name every time, but I oh, know. Oh, they call it something different. Every yeah, time? I know they do a lot of um, like showcases at Shaka. At Shaka, and thirty seven yeah. is thirty seven and Zen is always popping. That might not be the name next week, but they always popping yeah, <laughs> on the corner. Thirty seven, they have yeah. changed every other week. I performed that a couple times. See, yeah, yeah. 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 I, but I, but I want to see two thousand seventeen like. I feel like your wave is 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 now. Like you, it yeah. ain't even like it's a yeah. build up no more. Like I felt like the eat track was a build up. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Somehow, some way was a, a, a was a build up. You know what I'm saying? The seven track, I feel like you could. I feel like you could perform that. Yeah, you know that, what I'm that, saying? that's how I made it. Like that's what I I crafted the hook like that. So that way, when I do perform it, because it's a lot of times my people that ask me to perform somewhere, and I'd be like, I want to do it, but I don't do it because I don't feel like I had. I had that song like I could perform like yeah. it'll, just, it'll just be bars. Yeah, and I didn't want to do that to a crowd. I, like I, yeah, like I feel that's, like this. That, but that, wouldn't you want to see like a like crowd people, reaction like, too? Like, like, you know what I'm saying? I feel yeah, like people can. Yeah, but that's why I uh. wanted to just get me right. Once I got how, how I could do it, and I and I, I mastered it. Now I got my own recipe. That's gonna come with time. Any song I do that's now, I feel like cooking. It's right. interesting you said that. Um, you had bars and you wanted to to give like a different type of performance. Well. Yeah. One of our collective predictions for 2017 is that bars will come back. You said bars will come back in 2017. Yeah. So I don't want you to really but lose you need that. To dance. I don't no, think no, it's no. lost in your <laughs> songs at all. It never leaves. Like I do songs like that, but then I got the eat joint. Well, I can just go crazy. Like yeah, I can go crazy. Like I probably spit something before I leave here. Like just yes. oh yeah, we definitely need that. This this we definitely need you to set that off yeah. uh, for the rappers and put some pressure on some nets for 2017. You gotta have bars when you come up here. You gotta come have bars on here now. We, we definitely yeah, need that now. Um, what we do, uh, another thing we do here is uh, we get relationship advice. Mm-hmm. So we get relationship advice from all of our uh, listeners. You know, and they can submit relationship advice from what's the email again? Live from the seven five podcast at gmail dot com. Yeah, I got case to say it because I keep fucking it up <laughs> every goddamn. You did good last time. I, I've been trying to do good uh, with the email. They can they can hit us up in the DMs I as well. Yeah, you can you can always hit us. Y'all want to do it? And, and, and it's anonymous. And anybody who uh, does send us a question, relationship a question or whatever, we, it does remain anonymous. So uh, unless you tell case that I shout you out, I'm definitely gonna shout you out. Okay, um, but listen. <laughs> So we do. We got a relationship question today. Uh, I don't know who got it. Which one of y'all got it? 
Cakes, Cakes got it. Matter. Okay. So she's gonna ask you this question. We all gonna answer it, but um, we trying to give this person advice, mm-hmm. or you trying to give him an answer, but more. We so trying advice. to give him something good if we can. My advice. We trying to save something. Don't have a relationship. Nah. Oh my nah. god. Fuck oh. these bitches. Nah. Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Well, wait, nah, nah. Wait, In the back seat wait. though. Focus on the bag. Okay. That's okay. right. But look, look, look. That, and put rubbers not, on. That's not what we can tell our, our listeners right now. So listen, we got a question. <laughs> Kate's, at, Kate's gotta ask that question. Okay, so this was this is a disclaimer. Sorry, I had a drink or two. This is a disclaimer. Okay. We will definitely try our hardest to give you the best relationship advice that we can. Kels is like this is episode Ask six. Ask the right? damn question. I'm man. not <laughs> done. My disclaimer is oh be positive. Talk your shit. Say it with your chest, cakes. Thank you. Silence. They like my disclaimer. She they like my disclaimer. Get her stuff out. Oh. I can't answer the question. I can't answer the question. Anyway, we're going to try our hardest to give great advice. Kels is like, Owen, he only answered. You don't ask us that one question. (laughs) He only answered one question good. We on episode six. Okay. I have a question. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'm ready. If you break up with a woman and it's really over, both of you mutually cut each other off with no contact, like zero contact. And then 10 days later, she hit you and say she's pregnant. Mm. Does the man have the right to ask, is it mine? Mm. Dum, mm. Dum, dum. <laughs> Usually we answer these questions first, but guess, yeah, go you first. Definitely yes. got a, you definitely got a right. You got a right. Why is that? Elaborate on it. Elaborate. That, we, Why we would need you not have the right? Ten days later is kind of quick, though. You can you can ask any question you want to, whenever you want to. You got a mouth. But you know. you already made the stance that the best relationship advice is don't be in a relationship. Right. So is that because you're focused on what you're doing, or you've had some interesting experiences in the past? No, I'm focused out, on what you're doing. Shout out to the side chicks. Oh, you always got a couple people that you talk to that you keep in contact with. You know what I'm saying, but. All in all, you know what I'm saying? My main focus is on what I'm doing right so now. So what you're saying is that you promote what Kels was saying in episode one, the side chick contract. Listen, I got to say, what? <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Hold on, man. I'm listen, kidding. Listen. You know about the side chick? I'm, oh, only, listen, I'm listen, only listen. kidding. I didn't, I didn't brought you all the way a couple of people that <laughs> this you far. To. And you going to tell me you ain't, you ain't. <laughs> yeah, nothing, nothing, nothing. I don't got no girlfriend. Oh, Put it like that. Don't disrespect me like that. Come on, man. <laughs> It came a long That's way because now. you're the only well, person with a side chick We had a lawyer contract. write up the contract had, for we, us look, for the side chick. We had the lawyers write up a side oh chick God. agreement. It's on the page. Scroll down. Live from the 75 podcast. For those that you know, are in a relationship. Yeah, we got a side chick contract agreement on there. You know Hold on. There's some people that are in relationships that don't need that contract. You need to make that a meme. <laughs> it's definitely out there. It's out there. Matter of fact, I'll send it to you. Make sure that you, you get a copy. We're not reliable for anything that happened, though. If you have any broken windows... Keyed up cars. Yeah, that's not that's not, not us. Man. You know what I'm saying? We, so but listen, we nephew, still gotta answer the question. Nephew's vote is you have the right to ask any question you like. Yes, sir. That's because they're not together, right? So anything could have happened in the course of the ten days. Mm. I mean, I I kind of agree. Who's next? It's Chris, and then I mean, yeah, you 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 got it. You got the right. If you was raw dogging it, you get fourteen days, like a return policy. You get fourteen days. Hold if on, it's wait ten a days. Some return policies are like 21 days. Hey, if you go to Lowe's, you can return stolen shit. So, I mean, it's either way. 180 days. 21? <laughs> 21, 21. <laughs> um, like I said, it's, it's, most stores have 14-day policies on a return. You were raw dogging that 10, 10 days ago. You might so have questions. Pro- there might be you, a warranty on that Are box. you promoting unprotected sex? Because if you are, I'm promoting pills. Shout out to the Plan B pills, fifty dollars. <laughs> but um, he said you keep you, you fifty dollars on debt. All fifty dollars on debt. I think it's fifty two after taxes. You know what I'm saying? I don't know about it. It's just what the streets say. Um, well, I got three kids, so y'all already know what it is with me. I shot the club up three times. Um, J R Smith uh, smash from forty, <laughs> shoot your shot. I've been shooting my shot since oh nine, oh eight. Um, yeah, you definitely got the right to know. You, you definitely got, right got the uh, you know, it's, it's and I'm a, it's and, rules. And, and this is me. You know what I mean? I'm gonna be a hundred uh, after ten days. Uh, Ten I, I, yeah, days. I, I still I, matter of fact, I want to know. I'm gonna ask, and I want to. I want to test too. I want to test too. Wet, when the baby, pregnant, do, when the baby come box. out, I want to test too. Ten days though. Uh huh. Uh-huh. I oh need ten gosh. days straight up. 
Straight up, I need. That's it. it. Man, I need he it. Uh, so what you saying? Words. You need a, you need a ten day contract. I want. I don't care if it's one day. If we broke up and you come with it, listen. I don't care. I'm gonna I'm gonna be real disrespectful because we're not together no more. So I'm gonna piss you off. Yep. Yep. So in ten days. Yep. Everything yep. that happened in the bed. <laughs> Is yep. that it? Do the guys have anything else to add before nah, I give you my, a woman? Go ahead. My details. She's about to give us a damn book, so I'm just gonna leave that. Of the Go ahead and get your pillows ready. Okay. Go ahead. So <laughs> <laughs> this has never happened to me personally. I may know a friend that it did happen to. Uh-huh. <laughs> no, um, I think it's rude. It is rude. It's supposed to be rude. It's rude and disrespectful. Savage life. No, I, it's rude. Like <laughs> she's pregnant, so people, well, women fake so much to try to get the relationship like back. You know I, what no, I mean? No, no. So you can. So it's okay for you to ask because it it may or may not be your child, but I also feel that the delivery of the question is what matters. So if she say I'm pregnant, you can't be like, nigga, I don't know who child that is. Like ten days later, that's yes, not can. cool. You cannot you do can. that. Because we're not together no more. The you could have protected level sex is, the last time, the, and then the, she could have just the, went out and be a hoe and got them. The disrespect level is up. Got raw dog, and then, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> she want to come back to you. She probably going to ask you for gas money anyway. So, I think, I think it's rude. And then, too, I wonder, like, if it's a ploy to get the guy back. Is that, that's what I just said. Nah, she's trying to get that abortion money, go get but that Birkin bag. No, if, if women we just are petty. Broke, if and if, just your abortion, if your abortion costs the price of a Birkin bag, you fake just like this Birkin? Or I mean, I don't know, man. You know, <laughs> my lunch bag is a food line bag. Even know why. How y'all? How you know about abortion? He be Blazing? knowing the prices of everything. Uh, exactly that's right. Not how really do you know? I mean, I know in your country, y'all use a sword to kill. The- <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh! Hold on, wait a minute. Hey, usually, I have a comeback joke, but you got me. Don't y'all shout use out a, to, a, a, shout a out sword. to the Asian <laughs> listeners. Cakes matter. Don't feel that way. Bla- I'm blazing, you know what I'm saying? Hey, By the way, you know what I'm saying? I still got my black ways. <laughs> um, you know what I'm saying? You know, people talk, you know, the rap songs say the stuff all the time. You know, I'm a, I'm a connoisseur of the but rap music. But people rap so. about things that they don't really know about all the time. I mean, I don't I don't know about abortion, you know what I'm saying? I, He's lying. You know just saying? like he, he shouted out the exact price of Plan B. Plan B, the only reason why Because I, I had a paper back in the day in college. I, you know, I, I had a did, thesis I and do, everything. Five I deal drugs. <laughs> I deal drugs 24-7, so I whoa, know how much Plan B costs. whoa. I legally deal drugs. You uh-huh. can go. Uh-huh. You can go to your local government. There will be a license for case batters. You know, say I'm the big homie sometimes <laughs> to some of these people out here. You know, and I, I like to give advice. You know, what I'm saying so. You know, nah, I had a done. friend one time that needed it. You know, what I'm saying he asked a for the fifty. Hold on, wait a minute. Did they the ask 50? you to buy it or did they ask for the fifty? Because if you buy it and they're underage, you're going to jail. We're gonna edit this. <laughs> so I mean, you know, what I'm saying I don't. That is I can't a remember. Real law in this state. I mean, of every, everybody. Every, well, I mean, we was all over it. I, oh I don't know. Gosh. I'm not going to even elaborate on hey, that. Hey. But, you know what I'm saying? Just I had a quiet. friend that needed some help, <laughs> so I gave quiet. him some money. You've incriminated yourself six no, I did episodes not. deep. <laughs> just, 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 <laughs> nigga, hey, you no, going no. to jail eventually. At the end of the day, I wanted to make sure that he wasn't going to be an ain't shit dad, so we made sure he got the ain't shit money to get the pill. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I got him straight. Gosh. You, you know, did, I'm a good friend. You did the real thing as a friend. You know, so. Shout out to him. He still owe me $50, man. <laughs> You, you know have the right. He's driving Maseratis. We got a podcast now. now. You're not getting that fifty dollars back. <laughs> you have the right to ask if the child is yours. But listen, it's a delivery. That if you important. have any relationship questions, please. Contact oh, we got one us. more. We got one more question. We got one more. Um, that one just came in. This one just came in hot off the press. Okay. Email. This right for you, nephew. Uh oh. Is it? Oh my gosh. Is it's it possible <laughs> to have sex without feelings? And I know the answer to this, but go ahead, nephew. Go what ahead. you feel? You say no, nephew. Huh? Is it possible to have Answer. sex without feelings? Yeah. Hold on. What? Did you flip? Yeah, it is. We need an in-depth explanation. So, you, so you so hit the joints in the back seat. No. no. <laughs> we don't promote car sex. Yes, we do. Look. Car sex make make American car sex great Let again. Him give his you you done been to the club before, and you done left the club, and you know what I'm saying. You might have just did that. Just. Just because it was in the moment. So one night stands. We would one yeah. night stands. Shout out to him. Do, that, like, so one night stands ever turn into anything else? Uh, I don't, I don't. Sometimes it turns into ten night stands. <laughs> what you mean? Shut up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it turns me. in, I'm going to hit you on a night stand. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to hit you on. At the Ramada yeah, because, you know, we can't afford a Marriott. Oh, if, I, if, I could, if I could do that the first night, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't no more. Oh, wow. That's coming, uh, that's coming from nephew himself. Uh, yeah. I'm, I'm one of them people like, you know, 
Ain't hearing it again. It's you people like that, though. He just said right. one night stand. I heard it ten night stand. I hear it, 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 it once. I can hear it twice. <laughs> like, I'm a, I'm Get a, it right if, back. If we got a relationship, that's what it's, 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 that's all it's about. You know what I mean? I'm a dick. Yeah. Like I said, I'm focused, <laughs> yeah. I'm that's a new one. I'm focused on the bag. So as, as, he said he focused. That's on the bag. a good it, mentality it, in 2017. If, Let's if, get him an endorsement deal. If that do happen, then you know ain't no ain't no feeling. Okay. Um. So what you got? Blazing. You damn right. You can hit joints without feelings. You know what I'm saying? You know, I think you can. I mean, I, I don't know. I don't know about oh those situations. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know from experience. So, 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 so let's get the case. Case, can you get pipe without no feelings as a woman? Give the woman person. The woman is love. You know, the woman love your birthday. Her nails are done right now. <laughs> uh. What does that mean? Uh, her hair. Oh, her hair is longer than twelve inches, y'all. It's not yeah, though. It's done. It's actually twelve Bob inches on fleek. to be exact. Bob, Bob is on fleek. <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was gay. Shout out the rich way. Oh we man, don't, we don't shout out rich way. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take that shout out back. They didn't give us no advertisement money. Shout out to Joy Joy. Shout out to New York, New York, man. I know. Uh, what you buy your hair for that? Nah, I know Blazer people own Manhattan and <laughs> New York, New York. <laughs> No, I th- I think shout it's out to Sports Authority. That's where Kells get his gym gear hey, from. Hey, okay. Back back but to sex ahead. without feeling. Sex without feeling. I feel that. Mouth. Um. Oh my god. Go <laughs> I feel that it's kind of hard to have sex without feeling. As a um, woman, I think it is for both parties. Guys are just like they don't wear their emotions on their sleeve, so you're not really gonna know until until you know. Shoot your shot, 2017. It doesn't matter if she has a man. Go on her DMs. What? Okay. <laughs> no feelings involved. You trying to hit? Just shoot your shot. She gonna say shoot yes or no. Shot, I, I heard something about nephew giving us bars. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. We, get, we gonna get to that. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I'm so, ahead of so, myself. So, so, let's go ahead and wrap up this, this, this uh, dip. What is this shit called? Relationship, Relationship advice. advice. Kel's been drinking too. Let's that go ain't ahead water. on. I'm drinking water. That ain't, listen, that ain't listen, water. Um, he got some Bacardi in his protein <laughs> shake. <laughs> oh my uh, God. But listen, for all our listeners, definitely, we definitely appreciate it. Uh, if y'all have any relationship questions uh, or need advice, make sure y'all hit up the live from the 75 podcast at gmail.com. And everybody will remain, will remain anonymous on there. Or not. I mean, whatever you want to. Nah, we'll remain anonymous, anonymous on there. <laughs> My bad. Um, but um, let's kick this thing off, man. Um, we'll we'll go ahead and wrap this up. But uh, you know, nephew, uh, you know, you got some. Do you got some bars for us? Oh yeah. Cause yeah. you know what I'm saying. With this 2017, and um, uh, you know, we trying to set a new wave for the rappers. So I feel like you know what I mean. Right now, you putting a lot of pressure on people. So. You know, can you can you give us some bars for for two thousand? Y'all got y'all phones out. Y'all got your phones. I ready? mean, I don't have any followers, so no one. No, okay. Well, no listen, one's here no, live no with me. he gonna Nobody. spit something. Okay, do your thing. No shots. No bars. Okay, talk that junk. So, um, all year I'ma show out, sucker. So watch me show off. Start rambling. I can't think of topics to go off. It's crazy. Most niggas with chicken ain't got no sauce. Crown up, everybody royal, ain't no boss. Squad gold, shit y'all know. Crowns all gold, mall closed, gym open though. We still ball, hold no ball clothes, but how I'm dressed, she thinking athlete. I can't lose, doing good on a bad week. Maybe one day, but two days, this ain't the day for them. Starting to think these rappers sick, let us pray for them. Trump wins and they meeting and going yay for them. They ain't got the answers at all, better get sway for them. Mm. Dealt with a lot of shit, negatives and positives. Before I started rhyming inside as well, I would bottle it. Now before I even hit a track, no, I'm a body it. Snap back, backpack, looking like a college Woo. kid. No new kids on campus, the mm. deans couldn't stand us. Bro had that drum and I was trying to get my bands up. Probably got a whiff of the piff when I put my hands up. Just mm. got back from rolling over a gram up. How you learning? Look at the fire burning, nigga, now you learning. Loosen up, a pair of pliers turning. Yeah, you gonna be here for a while. Turn that tear to a smile when I'm tearing it down. Freshman week, they speak, but they stare at the ground. Lunchtime, think about dinner, preparing it now. And for any local rapper acting too large, I got a few bars, I bet a few large. I fuck them up in the schoolyard. 550, I'm popping, cause I'm a true star. See, they ain't got bars like that. I been putting in work, I got scars like that. Stop the make-believe raps like you got cars like that. Stop them bogus insta threats like you hard like that. I won't stop until the art is back. The seven God is back. Yeah. Yes. Let, me, let me tell y'all right now. I was with that. Can, we, can we rewind that? 
Nah. Hold on, hold on. Let me tell y'all right now. No, we Norfolk, not Chesapeake, Virginia Beach, Portsmouth, Newport News, Hampton, the whole seven cities, Suffolk. You gotta get your bars up. You get know your, what you I get just your bars got up though? right now. Yeah. You know I just got nostalgia from um big ticket the basement. Yeah, right? Like that, right? Oh my gosh. Let it's gonna, me be, a, it's gonna be a lot of writing. You it's gonna set, be a lot of writing after you Friday. Setting, <laughs> you setting the standards for when people come here. And if you feel yeah. like you need to come back and set some stuff straight, you how yeah. that case about to go. Like I said, like I said, man, this this is all the only thing I'm doing is I'm challenging my city to be better. I'm not challenging them like, yeah, I'm better, I'm better. I'm challenging every, even myself. Step it up. I'm challenging I like myself. That. It's 2017. It's a new wave. It's a new movement. Bars Crown, is back. Cr- Crown yeah. Up is out here. Crown up. Bars is VA. back. Bars is definitely back. And he's setting the standard stuff. right now. The seven cities. He's Y'all sleeping good vibe. tonight. He's setting a whole vibe right now for the city. Seven you know cities. What I'm and make sure y'all uh, uh, go ahead and shout your, uh, your, your your social medias out and all that, man. Plug uh, everything you can Instagram, think of. Instagram, double underscore, crown up, double underscore. And um, I, mean, I got my cuz, D Money, D M O N E Y, Dez, D E Z. You can hit him up for any apparel or features or anything, bookings, anything. Okay. You know what I mean? So, yeah, just hit me up. So you just working. working. 2017, you working. SoundCloud, uh, nephew, N E F F E W underscore C M K. Definitely check it out. YouTube, just type in nephew, N E double F E W. Yeah. Y'all know who it is. It's me, your boy Kells, on I G K E L Z Z Z 75. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram. Hit me up, DM me, all that. Just let me know what y'all think about the podcast. You know what I'm saying? All feedback is good feedback. Bad or not bad. Yeah. You know what I mean? Go ahead. Cakes Batter, C A A K E S B A G D E R. That's Insta, Twitter, Snapchat. This nigga got every social media. <laughs> I got out. Facebook, but I'm not Cakes Batter on Facebook, so if you don't know me, offer that. up all that. <laughs> offer <laughs> up Craig's <laughs> Craigslist. Every day, she got every social media. Go ahead, Blaze. What's up? R I P back page. Um, oh, oh man, a, a, lot, a lot of people Ooh. walked up to me. Wait a no, minute. wait a minute. Ooh. I'm oh, no. sorry. No, 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 Some no, no, cakes. No, no, I know no, them no, cakes. No, no, cupcakes no, no, now. No edit. No edit. I'm Ooh. definitely. I'm definitely not. We definitely on, ain't editing I'm that. I'm definitely not on back page. But a lot of guys no, that I it. wouldn't have thought you they walked up to me and was like, "Man, you know back page on." I'm like, "What? What? What?" Anyways, your boy Blaze and he robbed B L A S I A N. H E A T. Did I say that right? You, I don't know what you that's just right. spelled. Okay. R O C K. You know what I'm saying? R-O-C-K. Like R O C K. That's okay, right. You know what I'm okay, saying? They trying to question my spelling ability and shit. You know what I'm saying? I got a degree up in this bitch. I think I do. Oh um, my gosh. <laughs> like I said, you know what I'm saying? Y'all just heard some bars up there. So if you're a rapper and you trying to come up here, y'all might want to get your shit right. Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely. So, man, anybody who, uh, you know. Check oh, shout out to the side chicks, too. What? <laughs> But yo, this, I'm gonna go ahead. Let's go ahead and wrap this up, man. Episode six, live from the seven five, featuring nephew. We out here, crown up. Bars is six. back. Yeah, that way. <laughs>